The way I teach is by demonstration. I give basic, clear-cut concepts of how you do something, and then I take and I demonstrate. And I work with each one of the students, telling how I do it. It's a constant back and forth. The students are presenting me their work. I take and go over their work, and I demonstrate. And it's always uh, one concept to the next, the building. In a way, it's a one-on-one -on -one situation, demonstrating very essential concepts. Tools is what I refer to. These are tools, uh, and I also say there aren't any rules, but we have lots of tools. It gives you the opportunity to take and learn on your own to start with. The student can go in any direction they want. I'm not trying to create little villpoots. I, I, I take in fundamentals, they're universal. Uh, the, the student gives then has a direction. He knows uh, what he doesn't know and what he can learn. Problems that students have uh, pretty much are universal from all over. I have students in Norway, uh, Sweden, Finland, Brazil, uh, Japan, everywhere. And pretty much everybody has the same problems. They can be 80, 90 years old to 18 years old. I have students in my on-site classes that, who have never drawn before to instructors who are instructors at different colleges and universities. And it doesn't make any difference. It's the same basic fundamentals that uh, everybody needs to be able to deal with. One thing is that if you don't have a lot of experience, you have a tendency to think that every line has to be perfect. And that's, that's not true. <laughs> you, it's impossible almost. Uh, that you have to build the thing. You start from something very rough and you slowly refine it. But that, if you look at the Renaissance, that's how the artists work. Often the, the students don't have control over the basic tools that they're using. Simple things like being able to control the value of the line that you put down. The students don't generally approach things in a systematic way. And again, it's the question, the tendency is to copy rather than have a rational, logical way of approaching what they're doing. What I teach is traditional Renaissance drawing. The mechanics, the tools, uh, the fundamentals. The essentials are that this allows people to take and uh, create from imagination without having to have uh, an object in front of them. And for if you're going to work as a professional, that's what you do. I'm constantly, literally, getting emails or people coming up to me personally and thanking me for their career. And that, that as a teacher, that is really uh, the best compliment I can get. I'm Glenn Vilpu, uh, I'm a drawing instructor. <laughs>